Hi, my name is Alan, and I'd like to show you what's new with Spotify. We've added a number of new triggers, queries, and actions for Spotify. But you have to pay attention. There's something to win from IFT here. It requires some participation, so listen in as I show you some of my favorite automations using these features. Here's the first one. Sometimes you don't have the time to turn off your music before the next meeting starts. You can now turn off your music automatically 15 minutes before your meeting starts. IFT can help you find your next meeting in your calendar and then action Spotify to stop your music before the session begins. You'll use the Google Calendar as a trigger and with the Spotify service as the action. When the meeting ends, then I can resume the music. Now the second applet I want to show you involves using Spotify to record those tracks or albums in a meaningful way. I love music and I love being able to refer back to the songs or albums that I listen to in my day. I can now go into my IF Pro account and use my Spotify premium service to save an album of a specific track that I'm listening to. Once I save an album in Spotify, I can then create actions like recording the tracks to a Google Doc. I can then refer back to that Google Doc list of songs later. I can also do this with podcasts and shows that I save on Spotify as well. Sometimes the music really speaks to me and it's personal and private. I want to record it in my journal as a theme for that day. Well. I can do that with the day one applet. Every time I save a track in Spotify, it will send it and actually embed it into my day one journal so I can listen to it in my journal. The third applet is already made for you. Take a look. Suppose you're somebody like a DJ or somebody who wants to work with a lot of music and wants to share what you're playing with other people on social media. In that case, you can do that really easily by using Twitter and Spotify services to share what you're listening to. This can be done by enabling this applet right here. And suppose you're huge into the hottest music trends. In that case, Spotify has some applets that will allow you to automatically save 30 tracks from what Spotify calls Discover Weekly to a Discover Weekly playlist. So you don't have to miss out on what's hot every week. And when I'm on the move and I need to get in my car for those long trips, I can have music ready to go. I can create an applet that starts once my phone is connected to Bluetooth and then make an action for Spotify to start a song from my favorite car playlist. Then there's that situation when you have all your music playing on all your speakers and you're too busy or too far away to turn off those speakers. You can get those speakers to automatically turn off the Spotify music before your meeting starts. This is a special feature that you can action as a Spotify premium user. Just add your Google Calendar meetings into IFT and Spotify will turn off your music either you know, just before the meeting, 15 minutes or 30 minutes before your meeting starts. The fourth applet I want to show you is about doing a bunch of fun things all at the same time. And in those situations where you want to set a specific mood for a room, depending on the time of day or whether the weather changes, I can use the weather underground service to trigger Spotify to play my rainy day playlist when it's raining outside. I can also start a song, skip a track, even pause the song. And I can also add some lighting ambience with if pros multi-action feature to turn the Philips Hue lights in the room to a certain scene or color loop. When I'm done my work day and I'm working from home, like so much of the world is today, I can use some of the new actions available from Spotify to start my music or even a podcast like my favorite cooking podcast, and then set the mood with lighting or other smart home devices that I have in my home. We're betting that you have even better ideas and use cases for these new triggers, queries, and actions for Spotify and IFT. In fact, we're so sure that we'd like to give away two IFT Pro licenses to those of you who have the best ideas. We'll even throw in two Spotify premium licenses. So tell us below in the comments how you'd like to use these new integrations and then watch for our comment back to let you know if you have won. Of course, check below for full terms and conditions. Otherwise, good luck and happy ifting. Oh, and by the way, you can find the links to these applets in the description below.